Welcome back, everybody, to Plans 10 Minute Podcast, your podcast for all things building services related. I am your host, Ryan Diver. Joined with co host is president and CEO of Plan Companies, Robert Francis. And our special guest today is Bob White of Pinnacle Healthcare EVS. Bob, how are you doing today? I'm doing very well. Thank you. So, Bob, we want to just jump right into it. So, why don't you just tell us a little bit about Pinnacle? Well, Pinnacle Services was founded in 1989. We were independent for a number of years and we got very heavily involved in EBS services. We created a relationship with plant companies approximately six years ago with Rob, the CEO. And during that six year period, you know, uh, we kind of looked at how to partner up and scale Pinnacle into what it's going to be over the next 10 years. And Plan acquired us back in 2022, January 1st, and here we are today. That's awesome. And now you said, you know, you you typically do a lot more of the the healthcare uh, vertical. Could you uh, tell us a little bit more about like the types of, uh, you know, properties and and buildings and stuff like that that you guys uh, service? Mm Mm-hmm. Well, our first uh, realm into the healthcare industry was actually with the ambulatory center. Um, had four OR rooms, and we took that first step into the healthcare environment, and then we moved on from there. And we still have that customer today, 18 years later. And we have put on a number of healthcare facilities. And if you start looking at the healthcare industry now, it's a huge build out. You're looking at healthcare malls, I call them, where all the centers are into one center from cardiology all the way to ambulatory to infusion. And we're looking and focusing in on that market. Those average facilities run from 130,000 to 250,000 size we do. So as the market begins to expand, being partnered with plant companies is, gives us the ability to manage and make that market, now I'm losing it, but take us into a market that that we have the support. And I'm proud of our partnership. I know we're aligned on on values and and our cultures are um, established to to deliver on our service promise. And I've had the pleasure of getting to know Bob and Diane over the last five years plus and look forward to expanding the healthcare EVS vertical because it's so important, you know, for what we do, you know, enhancing the quality of life for for those we service. So one question from my partner here is the challenges that come into the healthcare vertical when servicing these buildings, they're, they're significant in a number of ways. Mm-hmm. And so I'd love for you to tell our audience a little bit about how, you know, what those challenges are and how we work uh, to overcome them. Well, the challenges are many. And the reason that we joined the plant group and plant acquired us is to take those challenges head on. Those challenges can go from onboarding hiring your EVS uh, candidate, taking them through the onboarding process, the medical shots. The key thing is training and moving them forward and continuous training or continuous readiness, if you would like to call it that. So plan has those abilities to enhance our ability to clean the facilities. The other challenge is, uh, is labor keeping them happy, keeping them moving forward, keeping them engaged, buying into our culture, buying into the plant culture, and then letting them understand that they're part of something bigger than just them. That's what I love, by the way, Ryan, about this vertical. Like it's, it's something that's so important about getting the right people in on board, onboarding them the right way, being in compliance, having the right infrastructure and depth of resources to deliver like this is not just cleaning. This is this is a specialized service where you really must be, you know, on your A game, disciplined, methodical, and that's one of the reasons why partnering Pinnacle was very important to us. This is a very important vertical. Yeah, absolutely. It sounded like you know there's there's a lot more rigorous steps that go into becoming compliance ready and and maintaining those guidelines. You know, ad- adhering to because they're pretty strict. Uh, mm-hmm. I, I just wanted to. It sounds like you kind of touched on the exciting future that you kind of see with the partnership of Pinnacle and Plan. But I wanted to go back, Bob, 
kind of what is it that that interested you in the healthcare space and kind of what got you uh you know so passionate about the uh, the healthcare vertical well to be honest with you we stumbled into the healthcare industry we were one and known as the best providers uh in the commercial cleaning end we did a lot of large corporate centers um and during that period of time we were recruited by a healthcare system in the area so that's how we got into healthcare after we got into the healthcare vertical, um, we realized that we had a special niche to provide high-end services. And over the last 18 years, we have built upon that and moved forward. And we have some of the most premier customers in the Philadelphia market. Plus, the employees, after they're trained, have a sense of satisfaction after they do clean something. They're helping people's lives. They understand infection control yep. and helping out society as a whole. And one, one more uh, question on this in terms of relationships, uh, both what I see with the team that's so dedicated and the clients, you and I've been at this uh, on this marathon for some time. Mm-hmm. I have relationships from my grandfather and my father, and I'm, I'm, a, I'm 25 years uh, in April. You have three plus decades of building Pinnacle and have some amazing relationships. Can you tell us from your perspective how you've developed those relationships and why have you maintained such great relationships? Well, relationships are important, there's no question, but it's a partnership. Everybody has to understand you have to understand the customer's culture, your culture, and be part of that partnership with your customer. If you have that partnership in place, the relationships will last forever. our first customer, we still have it after 18 years, and you move forward with them. As you transform into that, you create more partnerships and friendships within the facility. Your cleaners become part of the fabric and part of their culture. So it's more than just relationship. It's about partnerships. Um, so, Bob, where do you see the industry going? Like, I know you've mentioned, and rightfully, that how you train and onboard, uh, it's so crucial, getting the right individuals to, 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 to understand the importance. Um, but where do you see the healthcare EVS vertical going? What's next? Well, it's exploding. Um, as everybody knows, uh, hospitals, healthcare systems are constantly building bigger, better facilities. On top of that, as just with the healthcare industry, they're having issues with uh, finding uh, good associates or good associates to work with within the healthcare system. So, being part of that, we have really put together a fantastic onboarding system where we can actually get these people, or I should say, not these people. We should act, we're actually able to get our associates processed and uh, compliant and get them on board within eight to 10 working days, which is a, a great feat. So we're doing a lot more. And, and where do you of, see technology? Kind of Sorry, they, they mean, where do you see technology in terms of quality <laughs> control and compliance coming in? Now, I've always been a, a big fan of how Pinnacle has really you know, taken quality control. And I know you and I are looking at systems even today to elevate and enhance um, the reporting and the, and the, uh, breakdown of the uh, the rooms and the facilities. So where do you see technology going in that respect? Technology is the pillar of everything. Um, you need technology to process people. You need technology to train people. You need technology to inspect. You need technology to create schedules. You just need technology to keep the information straight. So technology is more than just one thing. It's a platform that is built around the healthcare system. And be able to take all that technology, incorporate with the customer's and user's uh, ability to understand that technology and information will propel us past anybody else. So as we work along with PLAN and, and Pinnacle Environmental Healthcare Systems, our technology platform will probably be second to none. We're way ahead of everybody else now, and we're looking forward to continuing that. 
Uh, I think it, it's going to delight the client. And I also know technology, Ryan and Bob, it's going to be big for, for our team, for our associates in terms of employee recognition, uh, career paths, promoting from within, recognizing living the core values of the companies. That's why I think Pinnacle and Plan with the culture, with our values have a real established, strong platform that's just getting started. So very proud that Bob and I met and got to partner together and you know, I, I love the uh, the next steps that we're all going to take in this journey and making a real impact. Awesome. Bob, thank you so much for joining. Uh, it looks like the future for the healthcare industry overall is very bright. Uh, where can uh, the people find you? People can find uh, Pinnacle on the internet at pinnaclehealthcareevs.com. And also you can call me direct at 856-861-0700 anytime. Beautiful. Awesome. Thank Everybody, you, Everybody, we thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, you can listen to the Plan 10-Minute Podcast wherever you find your podcast, YouTube, Spotify, Apple. We thank you so much for listening. Please like and subscribe, and we will see you next time.